Hola amigos. I was just sat here minding my own business, but then I suddenly thought, oh, hang on a minute, if I don't do this, no one's gonna do it. So here we are. We have got three new bottled beers in the craft and local beer shop in Limington, based in Visual Vibes. Three new ones. Now these are from a little further afield. These are from Surrey and it is from the Crafty Brewing Company. Um, so three of these. First one we got here, Blind Side. Blind Side, it is a deep amber ale and it is 4% volume, so that's the one. Another one here we have Lox Hill Biscuit. It is a golden ale and it is gluten free for you gluten free tonight. Yeah, so this one gluten free, 3.6%. And this one looks a bit like a, a Worcester sauce bottle. This is the crafty one, crafty one. It's a pale ale, it's 3.9% volume. So we're gonna try, I'm just gonna try one of these, but these are available in the Craft and Local Beer Shop, based on Visual Vibes in Limington. And they are, what are they? Oh, I can't, they're four for a tenner, four for a tenner. Anyway, let's give one a go. So I decided I'm going to go for the Worcester sauce, <laughs> just because I love the bottle. I might even keep that bottle. I really like the, uh, the the branding on there, actually. Really nice. I mean, they're all very, they're all very nice and bold. I like a bold branding. <laughs> right, let's let's crank it open. Let's have a little look, see, and uh, see what we uh, think of Crafty One Pale Ale. So looking at it, it is. It is, it is nice and pale. Oh, I'll say it's nice and pale. It's kind of gone a bit yellowy. Pop that over there. So, you can see it here. You can see through it. Pale enough. It's got a, like a light froth on the top. Uh, it doesn't look very carbonated. Don't know if you can see through there. Let's have a little sniff through. <sighs> so, first of all, we just nice kind of light malty on the nose. Almost doughy, it's got almost got a sort of a doughy, you know, bready scent. It smells friendly. Let's see if it tastes friendly. Mmm. Um. Oh that That's ruddy lovely that is. Really hoppy on the tongue. Balanced, a bit of sweet balance. Spot on. Mm. I've had it in the fridge for about 24 hours. Really lovely, refreshing, light. Light in general, but then that hoppiness is really like, hello, I'm a beer. Tastes like a real beer. Oh. Maybe. It's almost got kind of a fruity, almost like a dried fruit vibe to it, sort of sultana raisin sort of, but it's not explosively fruity. It's just got this beautiful bittersweet balance. Beautiful. Mm. And the carbonation is just right. It sort of fizzles on the tongue, but very gently and then disappears. That is lovely. Let's have a little look at this bottle, see if it uh, says anything on here. Pale straw in colour, with refreshment levels going through the roof. Uh, featuring Chinook and Sorachi Ace Hops, combined with Pale and Currapils Malts, delivering a smooth and complex drinking experience. <sighs> Nothing really else on there, but that is a lovely bottle. That is very nice, very nice, actually. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Mm. And I tell you what, when you sip it, you get that almost doughy kind of vibe. It's like fresh dough, like a fresh kind of bacon. It, it feels really wholesome and it, it smells wholesome and it tastes really lovely. Give that a go. Give that, I'm going to have some more in a minute. Mm -hmm. oh. So, as I say, we've got three of these. I will do um, a video on the other two Blind Side, which is the Deep Amber Ale and Lox Hill Biscuit. 
which is the gluten-free golden ale. So yeah, get on down. Visual vibes, craft from local beer shop in Limington. Four of these for a tenner. I would.